Yeah, can I help you? Yeah, I'm, uh, looking for my little brother. It's about your height, a little bit leaner, definitely less gray in the temples. Sam? Could we please drop this? Okay, I just don't want you to not take it because of me. I'm not taking it because of me, okay? Now, come on, man, what did I miss? Jeez, Sam, where do I start? Start with the best part. You, you tell me you stumble upon yet another archaeological gold mine, and somehow you manage to walk away with nothing. So this is how I got out of prison. What is that Avery quote? I am a man of fortune, and I must seek my fortune. Samuel, are you ready to seek your fortune? Hello guys and welcome back to Uncharted 4, A Thief's End. Last time we got to this, and there's my computer freaking the hell out. Anyways, um, last time we got to this. I can't this. believe I'm out. I can't believe I'm here, you mean. With you, in Italy, huh? <laughs> yeah, me either. Just wish the circumstances were less tense, you know? Eh, uh, well. You know, the sights are a bit more enjoyable that way. Oh, uh, so this, this isn't your first time here? Oh, it's more like, uh, third? Had a couple of odd jobs. With Solomon? Well, yeah. Okay. Getting right past that, the dialogue is much interesting to listen to. And there's our place, and... Boy, when I see tall flowers, I know what to die for. Just take cover. Somebody's gonna freaking shoot at us, I swear to... I swear they're freaking they're about to piss me off, dude. Anyway. Um, yeah, there's no way up under that bridge. Well, there's that exposed beam underneath. Oh, you think you can rope it? Do I think I can rope it? <laughs> Watch this. I'm, I'm about to rope somebody in a second. Anyways. I uh I missed. <laughs> nah, see it's uh it's all in the wrist. Nah. See? Yeah, it's not bad. A second attempt. And then when I reach this area right here, and then I. <laughs> anyways. I'm kidding. Did you see that? That's scary, guys. I'm sorry. It's your turn. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm going to keep saying it until I get sick of it. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make it worse in a second. Hey. We can swing off that beam up there. Uh, definitely. If Nathan Drake can, like, miss while standing and using both hands, what makes him think he can rope it on the first go? Um. I think. <laughs> intersection with Sam, I swear to God. Okay, here we go. <laughs> First try. All right, no one likes a show off. Okay, come on, Nathan. Hey, it looks like you can uh, climb oh, yeah. and make your way up. Get over closer. Right behind you. I see. I'm a dummy, as usual. Anyways. Hey. Okay. That sounded like he was gonna like jump off the opposite direction of the rope, but apparently he just grabs it anyway. One more swing, and then I'm good to go and press X and. Dream. Anyways. Game. Why you do this? Anyways. Hey. Seems a little far. Hold up. For some reason. Hey, es commesso sulla partita. Inghilterra vincente. Inghilterra, traditore. Eh, hey, non confondere l'orgoglio nazionale con la realtà. Ok, we're good. Jesus, did you see him? That Renner thug was packing some serious heat. Shut up our guns. Sam, we're gonna pull this off so smoothly we won't need him. I hope you're right. I have a strange feeling that there's treasure around here somewhere. <sighs> oh, I haven't gotten any yet. It's a little surprising missed the most. Uh, 
dialogue. Oh, I missed it. Or was that a dialogue thing? I nearly there. Let me look in this room real quick. I swear, if they added this room here, there's treasure somewhere. I've never actually been in this room. Unless I go downstairs. Let's see. Hmm. Not really. That should hold. All right, I stand corrected. No treasure in here. I don't see any sparklies. Anyways. And now we repel like James Bond and all that junk. Hi, <laughs> Jim. Whatever the hell I just said. Hmm. Yeah, tell me about it. So, uh, your other wonderful finds, uh, the ones I missed, you at least take any pictures? I wish. Elena filmed some of it, but camera didn't make it. That's too bad. I have some drawings, though. When we get back, I'll show you. You have drawings? <laughs> Are they up on the fridge or something? No, I, they're good drawings. Yeah. Can't wait. I pressed circle when I pressed triangle by accident. I feel like a dummy for that. Let's see. see anything to climb here <laughs> the game thinks I was stupid <laughs> look around <laughs> guys I'm I've been playing some Jack and Daxter or making the noises of it lately ah, this looks promising I think you mean precarious Shit! You okay up there? Yeah. I don't even have to talk. Just listen. Yeah, I'm good. Listen, to Nathan. He's doing all the commentary for me. I don't even. I don't even get why I'm recording Audacity. The game already speaks for itself. Let's see. Um. I'm missing something. It'd suck if you D missed right now. Never mind, Sam's doing all the freaking work here. But I don't miss. <laughs> I feel like a guy from SpongeBob just like waiting to deliver something. <laughs> Not copywriting anything, by the way. Anyways. Way to use a light as a freaking fixture for a rope. Uh, Nathan? Nathan? What? Oh, yeah. Okay. You all right? Yeah. How do I look? Like 400 million bucks. Let's go. All right, I'm right behind you. Sully? You know what I love about partying with a bunch of crooks? What's that? Nobody cares if you smoke indoors. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while. Too long, boy. Oh. You remember my dead brother, right? Victor? I'll be goddamn. Fifteen years. Yep. Good to see you alive, Sam. Mm-hmm. Let's, uh, let's try keeping them alive by getting this cross, huh? Yeah, uh, about that. What, what about that? Come on, let me show you something. Take a look. That's Avery's cross. They brought it out of storage just before you guys got here. They changed the lot order. Take a 
whole pile of cash to make that happen. All right, well, how long before they start the bidding? 10, 15 minutes tops. Well, there's got to be some way we can grab it. <laughs> there is just a small matter of a few hundred eyewitnesses okay, down there. Okay, okay, but we just need a diversion. Like? Like, um... Like, I don't know. But there's got to be something. Well, if the guards see <laughs> us making for that cross... But they don't see us. Jesus, you guys act like you never spend time in prison. If you want something dirty done, then you wait for lights, for lights out. out. Yeah. Where's that electrical panel for this place? There's ventilation. Electrical? That's it up here. So we just have to climb up there and kill the lights. Grab the cross in the dark. There will be an emergency generator. That'll give us a few seconds of darkness to work with. Meaning we'll have to be right next to the cross when the lights go out. So there's no way we can get that close without being noticed. Scusate, signore. <clears throat> Antipasti? I'm all set. Hi. How are you? Ciao. Don't you focus? The waiter wouldn't get noticed. That could work. Huh? <laughs> that will work. All right. All right, I'll, I'll get to the breaker room. Kill the power. You mean I'm the waiter? You're the best pickpocket. What? You head down to the floor, keep your eye on the prize, okay? Let us know if anything, uh, hinky goes down. Roger that. All right. Listen, we still got this. Ready? Ready. All right, follow me. We'll cut through the cellar. I did notice a thing about, uh, Sully's suit. It's, like, buttoned up at the bottom. But I think he has like a napkin in his pocket or something. I think that's like why he does. And I don't, obviously. I don't know. It's the small things I notice in this game that just make the most sense. It looks like we're number 1411. That's like the, uh, that's the cross thing, so, yeah. Crazy. Sarah's just through there. Let's go. This place is fancy. Of course they play the douchey European techno. I want to punch Sam, man. I want to punch him. me. And he's gone. Would you look at that? Here we are. Hey, let's do this. The hell, it's locked. Shit, it was open earlier. Now what? Can we pick it? No, it's electronic. I'm gonna have to find another way in. Let's get it. I'm gonna get it right now. Oh, real smooth. I'm not even trying yet. Yeah, I can tell. <laughs> I think the game does that to you on purpose. Just ruins it on the first go. Got it. Beep this bleep um bleep. Referencing a horrible song that I should probably not even reference on this channel. Okay. Alright. Let's try this again. We'll still need these. Great. Good luck. We'll be in touch.
Hands in the air. Hi, Victor. Hello, Nadine. <laughs> Pleasure to see you again. Only this time, I've got the drop on you. Well, I guess I should be glad that's not a real gun. <laughs> Hardly recognize you out of your fatigues. Yeah. You know how it is. Every once in a while, a job requires us to get all dolled up. Looking sharp, by the way. Not too bad yourself. You're so out of place here. Can't tell you what a relief it is to run into another English speaker. Even if you are American. They'll have to blame my parents for that one. <laughs> I was on my way to the bar. Can I get you something? Yeah, scotch. On the rocks. Be right back. Date. Catch all that? Yes, I did. Sounds like a lady's trying to buy you a drink. Yeah, Nadine Ross is buying me a drink. Nadine Ross? Wait, doesn't she own that army for hire? Is it called Coastline? Shoreline. Yeah, right. But you had a run in with them. It's putting it mildly. Fortunately, she does not seem to be holding a grudge. I'm good to go here. All right. Listen, we're all set, Sully. You uh, stay out of trouble, okay? I'll try. You ready? <laughs> Yeah, let's do it. I gotta find where the waiters and caterers are hanging out. And lure one out of the kitchen, probably. And let's go find the kitchen. Man. Maybe there's a treasure in this room. Let's find town. out. One. Oh, yeah. It's a full service site. No. Weddings, bar mitzvahs, black market auctions. Maybe I'm just out of it. Now. DJ. Who knows? <laughs> Had to roll at some point, and I just did. Crap. You see a waiter in there? Nah, just more heavily armed goons. What the hell is this? This game wasn't on the blueprint. Course. Okay, plan B. I told you it's locked. Trust, but verify. And it's. I don't believe anybody. Hmm. <laughs> Thingy thing. 2013? Feels like it's so long ago, but it's not. See some fence up there. Nathan, Can you push me up? up? I could have easily fit in there. There we go. Let there be light. Electrical in this joint. Don't suppose you brought a. F yeah, that'll do. I guess it's always a good idea to bring a smoker along. Unless see me to run. Oof. Man, I'm starting to get a little drunk off the fumes in here. Now, good thing Sully's driving. Hmm. All right. Looks like we're cutting through here and turning it. It's cl close, but no. Um, Maybe the vent access is behind these casks. All right. Oh, I have an idea. That's what if we went really through this vintage. side? Yeah, maybe crossed Alcazar through just settle here. For some good wine. <laughs> that's something tells me that's not bad. And then went around. Hey, uh, to wait for the light to follow me almost. Victor's chatting of Nadine Ross. I mean, heard some pretty scary stories about her crew. Yeah, don't worry about Sully. I can talk his way out of anything. There you go. Right, move, Sam. Get out of here, man. Uh, this way. Groovy. All right. Let's. Next way out of here, so we can move on, hey, so I can make. Hey, That's our way out. Yep. 
Let's find something to climb on. Or you can just give me a boost, man. Alright. Looks like the game is gonna make me just do yeah, things manually. Got... No need to give me a hand or anything. I'm holding the lighter. Hold the lighter. Okay. I would have caught myself on fire right there, man. I swear. Right there. That's smaller than it looked, huh? <laughs> and a lot more dusty. Cotton balls and Vaseline. Best way to start a fire. Jason, if you're watching this, remember that. Alright, and we are out of here in three, two. Uh, I stand corrected this time. Okay. You got a nice ass, Sam. Anyway. He's a nice arse. And don't take that too serious. Fresh air, here we come. Well, that's okay, because there's a ladder right here, and I can always boost up people, and I'm pretty sure that's going to be the next step. What if it is Check locked? This See that building with the radio tower? You mean the cell tower? The what? Whatever. Listen, that's the power room. Yeah, you're right. Let's see how we get past this gate. You don't. You can't open it. You obviously... D what did I say? What did I say, guys? All right. You can always say, like, in the comments, right. Alex, you cheated. You played this game before. Like, shut up. Shut the hell up. I can say what I want. Sully, we just got out of the wine cellar, heading to the power room now. How's it looking? Sully? You there? That must be a bad spot for a signal. Hopefully he's doing okay. Sam, look. Maybe we can use that, find a window, drop into the kitchen. That's a good idea. I'll boost you up and you take care of the ladder. Fine. I guess I'm always the climbing type. Got it. Heads up, heads up. Buona sera. Ma che sta facendo? Easy on the civilians, Sam. What? So he wakes up with a headache in his underwear. We've all been there before, right? <laughs> right. Well, I got mine. You get yours. All right. Okay, let's get to the power room. All right, let's get out of here, and we are going Sam, that way, I think. Um, yeah. Yeah, well, that's the style these days. Really? No, oh, we're in Rome. Nah, because we're in Italy. I get it. All right, I'm gonna head back to the ballroom. Not uh, at. <laughs> Sam, you there? <clears throat> Sam? <clears throat> Sully? <clears throat> Great. And then we <clears throat> drop, stop, and roll. I'm out of order. Stop and drop and roll is what I meant to say. I want to climb on those things right there, little windows. If I'm if I'm correct, which I doubt that I am. 
Um, let's see. I don't remember quite off the top of my head. Oh, never mind. Um, close, but no. That's not the spot that I wanted to go to. But it was those things that I pointed out on the windows. You'd think that it, that it never played Uncharted before, but everyone in the comments is going to be wrong. <laughs> Anyways. I'm going to knock it off with the laughs. Guys, got, we're, 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 we're moving on. It's not funny. Anyway. <laughs> I can't believe you got away with that. Oh, we did not. No, we had our liberty taken away for a month. And what about the horse? Fortunately, we had a lot of carrots on board. <laughs> <laughs> I recognize someone. No. I thought I did, but no. But when am I finally going to meet that partner of yours? Drake? Well, that's ex-partner. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've been flying solo for a while now. Drake's out. Oh. Like... Dead out? Oh no, more like retired. Mm. Last I heard, he settled down, got married. Mm. Well, then he might as well be dead, right? <laughs> Victor Sullivan! How the hell are you? Great. How long has it been? Ten years? Twelve? Fifteen. <laughs> it's amazing. All these years gone by, here we are, we're still haggling over dead people's junk. <laughs> really? Aren't you running your parents' business? My business now. But yes, that is my day job. <laughs> oh, that is one hell of a day job. You could probably afford to buy up everything on the block tonight. Well, sure. But what would be the point in that? And these days I'm only looking for the good stuff. Big scores. Any advice on what I should pick up tonight? <laughs> yeah. I think I want to bid against him. <laughs> but, um... <clears throat> Just between you and me, I did notice they changed the order. Hmm. I think somebody might be trying to rig this auction. Hmm. Well, remember where we are. This crowd didn't get rich by playing fair. Which is why you really need someone watching your back in a place like this. Ah. Well, I do hate to break it to you. You are working for an American. With? We've partnered up on this one. See? <laughs> Talk about a power couple. In a few moments, we'll begin bidding on our next item, an inlaid wooden crucifix from the Trotty State. Well, I know when I'm a third wheel, you two kids have fun tonight. Just hold on, Sully. How'd you find out about it? It? And what it is that, Rafe? Nadine, I think your partner here has had too many bloody marriages. Cut the bullshit, old man. Now, I don't know how you scammed your way in here, but if you think about bidding on Avery's Cross, I can tell you exactly how you're going to be leaving in a goddamn fight. Rafe! <laughs> well, you get my point. Lovely seeing you both. Nate? Nate? God damn it, kid, where the hell are you? Okay. Power run. I can get this. Now you might be wondering. I thought he fell off. No, no. It's Nathan Drake. He always lives. Anyways. Uh! That was not me getting scared of a fall, by the way. God, why did I pick the power? Oh. Did <laughs> why, man? First death of the freaking game. Are you kidding me? Remarkable, guys. Unintentional, by the way. I meant to jump on this, and I just... You know, it doesn't count. Nobody killed me. I didn't mean to do that. Alright, I didn't die. 
I feel like deaths in this game should be like based upon who killed me. And John's calling me again. And I'm back. Yeah. Um. Now where were we? Must be on this side. D Nathan, get on the. Thank you. Thank you, Nathan Drake. Um, this side, I believe, and climb in the pipes again, like a dweeb. Anyways. Um, no. Can I climb up this? Thank you, game. Thanks for being nice all of a sudden, even though you weren't nice to me in the past. Anyways, freaking cause me to fall to my own death. Huh. Nice roundabout detour. But that's not what I wanted to do. Let's go this way, I believe. Yes. Alright. I wouldn't think standing up in here is the best idea. Here we go. Now, where the hell are the circuit breakers? Ah, oh, crap. Sam, Sully, you there? God damn it, kid. Where the hell have you been? I made it. Had a few close calls, but... Yeah, well, if you're gonna cut the power now, it'd be a good time. Right, well, I'm gonna need a minute before I can reach the panel. We don't have a minute. Rafe's about to walk out of here with your cross. Wait, what? Rafe? Rafe is here? Yes, Rafe is here. And is right now, he has the highest bid. Well, I'll bid him. With what? I don't have that kind of scratch. Sully, we're stealing, remember? What if he calls my bluff? Uh, he won't. We have 90,000. Do I hear any more bids? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid. We're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Since we have no other bids. Trust me. Going once. Going twice. Oh, screw it. Then we have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? We now have 110,000 euros in the room. For a penny and for a pound. That bit brings Don't us worry. to 120. We'll be out of there in no time. I better be. Okay. Just gotta smash the lock. Let's look around. Let's raid. We're gonna destroy this whole room. Nope. We are now at 140. Nothing. Damn it. Gotta be something. Come on. Hey man, uh, I'm starting to sweat bullets here. Yeah, Everything give me a sec. Yes. Yeah, it just appeared out of nowhere. Senores, bit makes 170,000. And we're gonna smash the hell out of Triangle, and that just got done out of nowhere. No time. All right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's bid, 190,000 euros. 500,000. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have 500,000 euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to bid again? <laughs> Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once. Going twice. Then I shall settle for 500,000. Ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The backup power will come on shortly. It's gone. Move it, get out of the way. Stop him. Hey, stop that guy. Fermo. What are you doing? You're letting him get away. You speak Spanish. What? Sam, tell me you got the cross. I got St. Dismas right here. You want to say hi? 
Yeah, we've really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around. All right. Looks like we've made progress. Uh, big question is, getting out of here without getting shot up like a madman. Oh dear. Oh yes, hmm? I'm familiar. And I'm spotted already. Wait, wait, don't shoot at me! I'm lost! Hey. Hey, what is going on? I'm being shot at. Told you we should have got guns. I know. Alright, let's climb out of this window right here and get it out of here. Um Um This roof toppy right here. And then uh, this side. And up in this little area right here. And then we're gonna climb over and get the hell out of here. And up in the flowers. Look away for a wind. <laughs> yeah, I looked back and I caught. Put him right next to the pillar. Look away for a few seconds and, uh, yeah, he thought he was gonna get out of here live and he didn't. So. I'm on my way. Heading to higher ground to get my bearings. Alright, see you soon. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. So let's peek around and there are a lot of them. Wait for them all to pass first. I think I'm good. Um, I don't want to be seen right now, so obviously I'm going to get on this. Can I get to the very top? Can I get to the very top? Here we go. Okay. This window right here. Bam! Okay, everything's fine. No one got a good look at me. I'm just going to play cool. Stroll right on out of here. Oh, scusi. You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what, I won't tell anyone if you don't. You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. Really? Well, I'm flattered, but I'm afraid I'm spoken for. If you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I were... You won't. All right, fine. Just remember, I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. Don't telegraph so much. Nice try. I gave you that one. the artifact did you know all the artifacts here are stolen they belong in a museum I'm really losing my patience I look I'm still a little jet lagged how about we just call it enough or do you want to keep being a smart ass okay come clean you're no chiropractor the technique is really not helping my back all right wait wait it's in my back pocket where is it right there. <laughs> 
She's pretty good. How are you guys? I just met your friend Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this round sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good it's already right there. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that one was on me. I went straight for it, and it was like, uh. That was kind of embarrassing. I think it's this way. D Looks like he would have missed it, but apparently not. Um. Uh, do I keep going? Yeah, I do. <laughs> I went straight for it. Oh, That would be pretty scary in real life. What if I pulled the trigger on myself? I got one. Don't tell me it was nice. I can't get to you from here. You got a way down? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Okay. I'll meet you at the driveway. Just head towards the ballroom. All right, see you there. Getting all this stuff. Still all of it. Sorry. Do I mean to climb up? Sorry. Looks like today is not the day to mess around. Obviously. Alright. Obviously don't want to get caught in this. He's still alive. I'm taking it a little easy. It's my easy. Hey. I come around the corner. Being totally obnoxious here. Um, let's see. What am I gonna use this to climb up on the thing? I think so. I don't see what else to use it for, so I'm obviously gonna keep it here. Let's keep it real, guys. It's 2020. It's time to start keeping it real. Anyways. Looks like we don't have much of a choice but to like stay in cover for a, for a bit. And use the shotgun to my advantage to stay alive. There's that fountain just outside the ballroom. I'll meet you there. Got it. Let's go. 
Bam! And this is my fully automatic. Stay in the clear for just a little bit. I think there was another weapon right here. But I think I should stink I should stick with my instinct and stay with the full auto. Um. Stay moving. I don't want to stay uh, in one spot for too long. Alright. It looks like we're pretty solid for the most part. I still want to Pick up some leftover ammo and some stuff, and I think we're good for now. Oh. Hey, up this way. Right behind you. Sully, we're running Still don't want to remain in the open. Hold on, kid. There. Got one little small hit. Just take it very slow. Take your time. Don't rush. Unless you're driving a hearse, you better hurry. <laughs> Stay in the clear. I don't want to do anything rash and expose myself to it. I would have killed Sam there if friendly fire was on, but I don't think there's a way to turn that on. Especially in this mode, in this mode of the story. Um, I want this. Is he right here? The Fossa. Or whatever. Mufasa. Did I pick it up? No, I didn't. I, tch, I'm such an idiot. We are leaving, Rana. an asshole. <laughs> your brother. All right. Skull and crossbones. Very good sign. Xavier's the signal. What is this? Uh, Odie mecum eris in paradiso. Today you will join me in, in paradise. paradise. It's when Jesus said the St. Dismas on the cross. Right. But what about these numbers here? What do, what do you make of this? It's some kind of code or a phone number. <laughs> Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. This would be a year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. Well, uh, by most accounts, yeah, but it means we have date of birth, date of death, and paradise. Which means we're looking for Avery's grave. It's St. Dismas's Cathedral. <laughs> Wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now, look at this. The layout of this place is really unusual. Uh, here's the cathedral. But the graveyard is way over here. <sighs> Rafe's been focusing on the wrong area. Exactly. Guys, we're going to Scotland. All right, all right. Wait, wait up. You do realize that Rafe knows you're coming. Yeah, we can deal with that when we get there. Look, that psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. 
Plus, he's got Nadine and her whole army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. But come on, it's both, right? We need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all this? Jesus, kid. Look, it's just not that simple. But with all that you two have been through together... She wouldn't understand this. You are not giving her enough credit. I can't take that chance. <clears throat> Nathan, he's right. But things have changed. Rafe's involved now, and... I can, I can take this on my own, really. Great. Well, thank you for your input, both of you. Excuse me. Hey. Hey, it's me. Yeah. Now the reception's lousy. Yeah. Something on your mind, dear? Look, I, uh, I realize it couldn't have been easy. All those years away. And I'm sorry for what happened to you. But it's not his fault. I never said that it was. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. You see a gun to his head? He chose this. Okay, he's meant for this life. You really believe that? Why are you here, Victor? Because somebody's got to keep an eye out for him. You know, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Yeah, I will. Okay. I love you, too. Bye. Just told her that the job was going to take a little longer than expected, which is the truth. Right? So come on, what do you say? Sam could still use our help. Well, <clears throat> I do hear that the weather is particularly fine in Scotland this time of year. Oh. Rafe's really going all in, isn't he? So they're all concentrated around the cathedral, so that's good. Because we are going to have that graveyard all to ourselves. <sighs> Sully. Yeah? Hey, listen, we're good to go here. Okay, kids. Happy hunting. Last chance to come with. Yeah, well, unless you can find me an escalator, I think I'll pass. <laughs> all right. See you in a few. Uh, hey, Nate. Yeah? Just, uh... Ah, uh, just bring me back something shiny, will you? That's the plan. Well, let's go pay our respects to Captain Avery, huh? Scottish Cathedral. <laughs> Strange place to bury your treasure, no? no? Not really. I mean, by the time Avery would have sailed here, place was already abandoned. I guess that's true. Plus, with a massive bounty on his head, it'd be a good place to hide. So, uh, what happened between you and Rafe? Nah, I couldn't deal with him. I'm pretty sure he'd had enough of me. I was still coming to grips with your, uh, death and with his frustration from not finding the treasure. I'm pretty sure he was ready to kill me by the time I bailed. <laughs> Imagine what he want to do to you now. Yeah, <laughs> trying not to. Sam, listen, he's ruthless. I mean, even more so than when we teamed up with him. Well, looks like I wanted to let all that dialogue pass by before I end off, it, and before I end off the episode. But that was pretty good. Um, I'm going to end it right here. So I hope you guys enjoy this very uh, embarrassing uh, death couple montage uh, of Uncharted 4, A Thief's End. And I will see you guys in the next one. Subscribe, like, comment, or anything else. Peace out, guys.